Hello everyone, welcome to another episode of Victoria 3 and we are finally going to continue with the East Indian Company. I think it's been 5 days since you had the last episode and apparently 7 days since last I recorded about it. Hopefully you still enjoy the streams with the US that are coming up, but it is a bit different with playing this YouTube series at the very least. We had some... Well, crazy civil wars going on last time, and um, it went pretty good and well for us. It's 1843, we are removing traditionalism, we don't have slavery anymore, and uh, we have more or less changed our com political landscape completely. We might still have some issues with landowners trying to rebel now and then, but um, if we manage to push them down a bit, it would be pretty great. So uh, thank you for your comments and suggestions. I really liked one comment that was how about I try to actually use the trading system this time and like try to go for it quite hard. Like for example, we should really be exporting this. Like if we do a new export route, yeah, exactly. We will be able to, oh wait, if we actually do this. Uh, let, let's just kind of see what happens. I haven't used training system at all really, like are we actually going to earn quite a bit of money from it? Are we going to earn nothing? Uh, let's see, right now we're earning 35 from grain, are we going to earn like 100 now? Like I expect that to be something around there, but there we go, we set up a bunch of trade routes. Uh, actually, is that the only trade routes we have? I would like to separate, yeah exactly, I would like to separate it and see in actuality how much we're earning. Let's try to like learn the trading system together. Well for this series. Uh, otherwise, Doctrine of Lapse, basically, apparently we annex one of our subjects, and I think it's better for them to be beneath me once I'm independent. But at the same time, it might take a while, it might be... Let, let's just try it out. So, uh, they become radical. So it's basically, I, it, we're gonna get some infamy and it's gonna be a bit more radical pops. So I do actually think I want to avoid it for now. Uh, let's see, is there anyone specific I would like control over? That wouldn't be too bad. Uh, let's see. And we'll end it right there and I can't see, oh there, to the far west. All of these are kind of fine. Uh, let's just clean up our borders and take there. That looks a bit better. That was like a million more pops. Yeah, I think we're gonna. Uh, I think we might just hold off a tiny bit on the entire, on the entire annexing everything. Uh, all right, so let's see. We're definitely gonna need a train station right there. What are we otherwise doing? Yeah, we're just building a bunch of government administration buildings. Uh, or well, yeah, that's actually our decision. I was thinking maybe it was in a new area we used annex, but no, we we're fine. Uh, let's see, you're just building a bunch of that, that's fine. Gold has been found in Victoria. Ooh, that might actually solve some of our money issues. Well, I guess we don't really have money issues, just... Um... <sighs> God damn it, we're paying so much money to the UK, 40k. They were instrumental and really, really crucial. Let's actually change camera. <laughs> in us actually becoming independent, well, not independent, but... Um... Fixing our civil wars, like having other people fight for civil wars when they're over mighty. <laughs> that was perfect for us. Uh, let's see, landowners. No, I don't want landowners to get any more support. Just push them down as much as possible and getting this right away. That would be so fantastic. Removing this minus 25% tax capacity and... Oh, that would be so beautiful. And of course, this is only 25% private construction allocation right here up to 50 percent and we don't have all those negative modifiers that would be so fantastic uh let's see otherwise we're getting so little research we are really i really want to spend some money on fixing that uh maybe this this might right now i don't feel like it's actually 100 worth it doing all of these since we're basically paying more for the government administration to run than we're getting from improving the tax capacity but maybe with this new law, we are actually going to start earning money on it. I do expect this, since we're going to get 25% better. Wait, wait, actually, is it 25% better or is it just removing the 25% penalty? Yeah, we're just removing the penalty. 
we have. So, um, hopefully, this is actually at least going to go down to 200k. That's what I'm hoping for. But um, I honestly have no idea how much that's actually going to affect. Otherwise, you can see our two civil wars going on right there in the GDP. <laughs> so that's, uh, let's see, 90% literacy, 8.2% standard living. Yeah, we really do need to fix it. Another person had a great, actually, I think that you had both of us here with trading. And yeah, exactly. And you wanted us to get, basically, of course, independence. And you wanted GDP and standard living to be the highest in the world, which is indeed a possibility with something like India since they're such a massive nation and have access to such a huge market of all resources that possibly exist so uh, let's uh, let's figure let's figure something out so tariffs how much are we getting from I don't see grain right there they're grain 60 so we're honestly only getting 60 because that's a very very slight amount we are sending away all right uh, let's see if we can do this then. Uh, trade actions, no. Export, yeah, yeah, that's not what I'm looking for. I'm looking for the button that says, uh, let's see. Uh, highlight here. Uh, considerable export demand, yeah. Okay, we have cloth. Balance plus 2k, productivity. We should relatively be fine with doing all of these trades. Uh, let's see. Sugar. One right there. Uh, let's see. Otherwise, we have medium taxes on. That's fine. Trade routes. Yeah, we are earning some re uh, revenue. Uh, let's go in here. And yeah, we're still completely fine with all these. Export route. Sending some alcohol to some people. Actually, to a lot of people. But that's fine. Coffee talk. Let's see. 5% uh, enactment chance, or we improve. Uh, let's see. Uh, I don't really care, honestly. Both of them are relatively fine, but I would like the interest group to get, become a bit more popular. So either way, I think this one is better. Uh, oh, if that guy, of course, wasn't exiled. All right, let's see. So, still losing quite a bit of money. I would really like to avoid it, honestly. Um, how much are... Yeah, we're paying 9k interest. Yeah, we're going to finish what we're doing right now. And then we're just going to sit and relax for a little while, unfortunately. I, I'm, I'm betting quite a bit on that this is really going to improve our income. Uh, if it's not, then... Uh, well, let's just say I'm going to be sad. Okay. Uh, second objective after that... Hmm, what do we, I think we want to remove serfdom, but, um, hmm, potentially, we'll, we'll see, we'll see, and finally, pass one step, and come on, just, just, just give me this, just give me this, please, <sighs> god damn it, uh, oh, landowner, she can go to hell, so it's either landowners become... Yeah, damn it. Uh, then I'm just going to do this. Thank you. Okay, only losing 3k now. So we're going to earn 20k once we've built everything. Yeah, I should have probably stopped early. Minus 12k right there. That's just... That's like two free buildings being built. And it's... Ugh, in vain. Let's see. Services. We're actually missing services. Are you kidding me? Well, actually, it's maybe not too unlikely. I don't think I've done too much. Oh, wait. Now... I I was questioning why everything was changed, but like maybe I have done custom setups all the way. No, I haven't. Uh, let's see. Uh, well, actually, that might be fine then. Let's see. Okay, let's have another look at everything right here. Leaded glasses, we should be trying to do that, please. Urban centers, I do want market stalls. I do want this one, please. Thank you very much. Anything else that looking a bit weird? Yeah, soil enrichment, please. I want a better right there. That's fine, that's fine, that's fine. What happened with the music? Thank you. Very much. Please improve that a lot. <sighs> really? That's it? That's it? Really? 
so sad. Oh, that's so sad. I was really hoping on something better. So it reduced it by 20k. We are really gonna have to do some more changes then. Alright. <sighs> well, let's see. What are we missing right now? We're missing wood, we're missing food, we're missing s services. Okay. Uh, how are we doing with coal? That's the most important thing. Minus 1k. If we fix... Minus 1k only? <laughs> wait, 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 yes. wait, yep, sell orders. Oh, because of from all our puppets, I'm assuming. But we ourselves have nothing, and we don't have skilled laborers either. <sighs> all right, all right, let's, let's just do this right now. I've been kind of trying to avoid it a bit, but uh, where the hell is also the music? Come on. It feels so awkward to just sit there without... Did we somehow bug out the game? So we don't have any music anymore? Maybe? <laughs> uh, let's see, colonial resettlement. We want colonial resettlement. Uh, that's fine, but is there any area we could potentially colonize? I guess we could colonize Indonesia. Uh, could we somehow go into Africa from the east? Does not look like it. Alright. I guess we could go colonial affairs, but... Um... Oh, here. Uh, let's get a point of bureaucrat as well. Let's boost our taxation capacity even more, please. Thank you. Uh, anything else? Oh, yeah, I'm, I'm just going to do like this. Quick save. <laughs> and actually just <laughs> load the game. Let's see. Are we gonna get our music again? Here we go. I should have just done that. Alright, there we go. Now it feels a lot better. <laughs> it was just so quiet all the time. Alright, let's see. So we're getting the appointed bureaucrats right there. That's gonna hopefully then give us another 20k bonus. Uh, unless they stack upon each other. Which? Oh, 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 wait, wait, wait. 2 plus minimum standard living from literacy, uh, universal pop string, 5% qualification. Okay, this is going to be a bit of a pain for us right now. Yeah, we're barely going to be able to sustain it with the lower strata. But yeah, let's do that. We're going to get more qualifications. But we're also going to push now for... Uh, wait, we don't have any universities? We don't have any universities in the entire nation. Hello, okay. Um, let's begin with one per million I think so uh, or well one per at least <laughs> one per open laborers million um, but let's begin just with this very easy very like nothing too complex and yeah we will succeed where Portugal failed so we are once again missing money uh, could we somehow fix that Luxury clothes, at least pushing it a bit. And then luxury furniture, let's do that as well. And we're barely earning money. Or we're actually barely losing money. Which I'm completely fine with. And yeah, we're already... It's already going upwards. Very cool. Uh, over a drink. Uh, yeah, I'm fine with getting the industrialist a bit more power. Okay, we're missing 6k now. <sighs> expensive, expensive, expensive. But uh, what can you do about it? <sighs> Unrealized taxes. Yeah, I know. I know, I know. Don't you worry about it. I know. I would love to fix that, but... Uh, Appointed bureaucrats, thank you. Getting one level right there. Fantastic. Yeah. God, may maybe maybe that was an issue we did. Actually, we didn't actually immediately start doing this. Wow, if, we, if it's actually being bumped up that quickly, that we should have done this a while ago. Uh, Alright, let's see. So we're doing nitroglycerin now. Uh, would love to go military so we can start going independent because that's 40k that we're just shucking away uh, to UK. Maybe we should go for that military stuff. Uh, Social security, nothing really important for now. Is there anything here that would actually give me that this one? That's 10% more defense. And then we have skirmish infantry. Let's get both of them. 
Yes. And I think we might try to go for independence after that. Depends a tiny bit on how strong Great Britain is at that point. They have 1.2k right now. We have 400. Yeah, exactly. We are quite far away from them. Uh, we do have... Yeah, we exactly. We have maxed out everything we can. But it's not looking too fantastic. How are we doing? Yeah, exactly. We still have peasant levies, which is rather terrible, honestly. My so, oh, professional army is massively... Oh, what? We're gonna get professional army. Uh, let's see. Oh, who is rolled? Yeah, you are still land Who cares about them? Uh, yes, exactly. Let's do that one. Just push it through. Screw, screw the goddamn revolution from landowners that are once again happening. I told you, they are going to come back now and then and be a bit uh, revolutionary. But um, we can probably sort it out. So, we're going to go into rule. We are going to get some nitroglycerin up and rolling in this club. Um, we don't have any munition plants, no. And um, We need to do this. Thank you. We need to get that. Get a few more of these. Get more sulfur. Uh, let's even start the steel tools, even though I probably don't have steel. Uh, wow, we had quite a few of these that we need to upgrade. Just push it as hard as we can. Thank you, getting that as well. Uh, anything else we are missing? Fishing, thank you. And sawmills, yeah, that's fine, cool. So, what are we now going to miss terribly much of? Uh, nothing. All right, backroom deal. Come on, you, you, you just push that through, please. Enactment time, minus 30%. While it's being, yeah, exactly. W only while this is being on, going on. So, shortening this. Oh, wow, actually, by quite a bit. Cool. Uh, let's see, we don't really care about this. Minus 10%, yeah, exactly. Let's reduce their... Bonds. Oh, and suddenly we're earning 40k. Oh, because we're not building anything. That's why. <laughs> I was really happy for a second right there. Uh, but no, okay. Uh, gold mines, we only have that maximum built. All right, then we're just going to go down one. Oh, wait, lead mines? Do we, ha do we have any lead? I think we do, but probably not too much of it. Oh, by the way, how much are we earning from all our trades right now? Still nothing. Okay. Uh, maybe because we are... No, we are... S Ugh. Okay, we'll see. We'll see a bit later. I, I will. I will deal with that later when I feel we are in a comfortable position. Uh, so lead right there. Yeah, we can definitely fix that a bit. But right, right, right. We're not going to do it right now because we don't have enough qualified people. Uh, by the way, what kind of loss do you have? Uh, you have nothing still. Yeah. Okay. Uh, let's see. We have one in all of these positions. You actually have some qualified people right there to actually support this. Uh, but let's get everything above two hundred k. Uh, let's do this, and then we're gonna get, like I said, one per million free laborers, so it's gonna be quite a bit, and there we go, fantastic, so, drop that please, oh god, we're also missing 600, right there, um, that need to be fixed, ASAP please, and that's probably more important than uh, most things, so we're gonna get two there, two there, two there, to begin with and yeah you're gonna be highest priority yeah cool uh let's also fix iron framed everywhere so we are gonna pay a bit more money just make sure we use maximum production efficiency as uh, let's see liberal party conservative um sure since reducing conservative part a bit, a bit less um right then we're gonna go into peasant levies we're gonna get our professional army set up thank you for that uh, let's see, 60, oh yeah, that's, it's going upwards, but very, very slowly. My lord. We are <laughs> gonna really struggle getting this up and rolling, aren't we? Tax waste, 9%, but unclick taxes down at 34, I like that, I like that. Okay, I think the one government administrations we did is gonna help out, and we got just straight up 15% right there, fantastic. Uh, UK. Right, right, right. I need to keep track of you. I really do need to keep track of you. I need you to get into a large-scale war. And not these tiny little thing right here. And as soon as you do, I am going to just straight out betray you with a civil war. I want you to, like, yeah, go, go to war with France. That would be fantastic. Or Spain, or Prussia, or anything like that. And then we're just going to break off our independence. Uh, are you still allied with Portugal? No, you are not. That's fantastic. 
That's fantastic. Okay, cool. Then at least you're not going to have a walkway into my nation. You're actually going to have to navel and wait. And that really brings our chances from impossible to maybe. Uh, we have 10 million radicals right now. Just something I'm going to have to accept. We can't really do much about it. I was really hoping the 100% white right here was actually going to give me something. But um, yeah, not going to happen. 60, yeah, 68,000 loyalists per month sounds like a lot but um when your entire population is what is my entire population uh let's see 132 million it's unfortunately not too much uh let's see oh 50 percent legitimacy come on 100 percent, please thank you very much uh and we're boosting down you i probably don't need to suppress you anymore i think you're rather f oh no you still have a very high oh shit now i screwed up because now i don't have enough to actually suppress you i'm gonna have to remove one of these and then go back right here governments uh come on what overview no suppress thank you uh cool uh, they still have a lot of clout coming from their recently suppressed. Uh, at least getting this, it's going to reduce their power even more, right? Yeah, exactly. 25%. Yeah, they have 25% political stream coming from this. So going to pressure army is going to help us that way too. Uh, 70 million GDP right now. Looking better. Pressure army law, law enactment one more time. And we're going to be good right there. Excellent. 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 Uh, getting even more. Yeah, 66, so we're earning 16 more already. But uh, our literacy seems to be completely <laughs> completely still at 19%-ish. All right, all right. We have a very tiny navy. We're not going to be able to challenge, of course, UK in any way, shape, or form with that. And there we go, professional army. Thank you for that. So that means we can right now go in here, development, and... Just bump up our conscriptal. So basically why this is super important for me right now is if UK would naval invade me, for example, in an area where I don't have any troops or both my armies are busy, it's going to be the conscripts that are defending. And if my conscripts are pretty decent or at least at the same level as my normal troops, they should be able to defend against a size, well, a decent size naval invasion at least. So, um... Very important for me right now to keep everything up and rolling properly. Uh, North Bengal, you do at least have it fully worked. I guess I'm just going to get a few more government government administrations right there. It's just so much money I might be able to gain from that. Uh, let's get like uh, three of them at the very top right now. I fix that, that's going to fix my bureaucracy and then we can just keep going there. Uh, how much are we actually paying? North Bengal. No, that's South Bengal. Um, come on, North Bengal, thank you. We are right now paying 14,000 for this. Uh, because paper is apparently incredibly expensive in my nation. Uh, let's fix that. Paper, paper, paper. Yeah, oh, that was not paper. This is paper. God damn it, Daniel. Um, we should have looked into that a bit earlier. Uh, let's get five. Let's get ten in Bombay. And let's get it now. This is massively going to help us. Uh, is it sulfur that's super expensive? Or is it something like that? Is there something I've screwed up? Uh, what I'm trying to do. I'm trying to do this. Uh, and then check right here. South Bengal. No, it's just that the severe lack of paper is right now causing it. So fix this. Minus one eight. Come on, we, we still need to fix that, please. L l just, just do the government administrations make me pay even more money for it and then we can fix it later uh uk in a big dangerous war yet nope other way around you are not doing anything <laughs> uh, consolidate colonial rule uh keep separatists below 30 for at least wait what Now, uh, Conqueror's East Indies is not yet complete. Any native zone who's still available must be brought to the heel, and any hint of popular resistance must be crushed. Keep separatists below 30 for 10 years. Alright. Okay. Uh, consolidate the colonial rule. Is that I'm just gonna straight out annex, annex everyone?
Maybe. I, I don't know. Or is it just gonna allow me to do this cheaper? Or... Or East Indies, yeah. I guess we'll see. I guess we'll see. So, trade export to Yen is, is inactive. Uh, wow, most of these we're actually not earning money on. There we go. Cancel that. And now we should be earning it. Yeah, it's still more or less the same. It's barely worth it, honestly, trading. Right now, at least. Um, actually, thinking of this... No, we're not trading any huge amounts of anything, actually, right now. We should... This is what we're earning the most money from. And most of it is Tarek still. Uh, if I freed it up, they would trade more with me, rather than restricting everything to myself. We'll, we'll see exactly what I do soon. But yeah, getting more paper, that's at least going to reduce our government expenses and hopefully going to make the entire thing much, much cheaper. We are paying quite a bit for that government wages. Oh well, paying a lot for the government administration. It's a goods for government buildings. Uh, 2k right there. And phew, look at that, 87,000 for the paper. 2k for the universities, 87. Wait, really? Only 2k for universities? <laughs> that sounds incredibly cheap. Oh yeah, because you're barely using any paper at all. Uh, could we please upgrade you? Uh, philosophy department, uh, we need dialects. Uh, what are we currently researching? Uh, the military stuff. Uh, let's do that. Shift click, right? Yes, perfect. So finish what we're doing and then we can go to dialects. Yeah. Uh, or actually we can even do like this and then we go that one. No, 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 no. We need to be, we need to be ready. We need to be ready for the potential war that, um, UK is probably going to have at some point. And we are even getting this spread right now for it. So that's pretty good. Okay. Should we conquer anything while we add it right now? We could try to go for something like Burma. That feels like it could be just some free real estate right here. And it's going to link us up with the East Indian Company right here. Well, our own territory, that is. I'm so, feels feels weird to say. Uh, we could also just force them to become our puppet. That wouldn't actually be too bad. If we only have so many puppets, what's, what's one more puppet, honestly? And they are rather large. They have one, two, three, four, five different areas. Taking all of them one by one will definitely result in more. And we can just annex them later. I think we are going to just make them a puppet. Uh, it's only 24 infamy and country... Oh, UK might side with us. Okay, then we're just going to do this straight away. Not think too much about it. I do want to see what my stats are. And if I compare, can compare them with UK at the same time, that would be pretty good. Uh, let's see. So, yeah, we, we're just going to walk in right there and crush them most likely. Uh, field works. 10% army defense and 5% less morale. And then we're going to get skirmish infantry right there. If we rush... No, no, that's stupid. No, uh, that was even more stupid. I didn't mean to do that. I was thinking if we somehow rushed trench work works, that would be 33 years. <laughs> um, that's just to do this research. No, no, that's... No, that's not. <laughs> Let's not. Let's not even entertain the idea about it. Uh, there is certainly probably some nation in the world that would be possible. Uh, we're gonna ban dueling. Uh, where that would be possible to really quickly get really high in military stuff. But, um, well, not for, not for little India right now. So, how are we doing right here? Can you support me fully with the professional army? No, does not look like it at all. We definitely need a larger arms industry. Uh, let's see, where do we have ugh, barely any qualified workers anywhere? Uh, but I'm still thinking. Wait, wait, wait! No, no, no! I'm not gonna do it right there. We did have, let's see, Malaya, Malaya. Uh, oh, really? Okay, I I'm gonna get you one arms industry, even though. Yeah. Okay, we are gonna get more here. As well in North Bengal. Let's get two right there. And then we'll see how it works out after. So. Just walking in here. No issues. Yeah we're fine. 
so whenever you want, just give that up and join the East India Company. I'm always trying to avoid saying East Indian Trading Company because we're not the East Indian Trading Company. We're right now the East Indian Company because we're not trading very much. <laughs> uh yes okay we're desperately missing hardwood right now we have come to that situation uh we're missing wood as well that's the issue i'm gonna take these 11 and you're gonna do this that's at least hopefully gonna fix the desperation of hardwood no it's still desperately missing hardwood uh let's see what we're we currently building what have we planned yeah quite a bit of stuff uh we're earning 30k right now when building with maximum capacity so it's definitely time for us to bump this up so let's get five more in delhi and then we're gonna look into how we can improve it after uh yeah yeah we oh you're just gonna walk in here and take this yeah that's that's fine by me sure temporarily hold this don't worry about it it's fine uh, let's see, so... Is this it? We're still earning 25k, are we sure about that? We're still earning 20k now? What a coup? Uh, no, how about not? Uh, actually, we're not doing any law changes right now. Please, let me do some law changes, because we have more to do. Uh, home affairs, I would love a little secret police, if possible. Uh, but is that actually the most critical thing we want to do right now? No, I would love to remove uh, serfdom. Uh, we don't want tenant farmers. We will fall population, uh, not part of our laws. We need mutual funds for that. Uh, where is that? Ah, it's that one. Yeah, that's going to be a while before I have it. Then I guess this is at least better. Getting the rural folk a bit more power. Then serve them. Definitely. So let's do that. There we go. Uh, barracks. The coup advanced by 10%. Uh, that's fine. Don't worry about it. It's completely fine. And you want serve them to be hauled. You have 63%. Yeah, not gonna happen. So I think we're probably fine with changing this. Cool. And it's also gonna reduce their power by... What is it? This is increasing it by 50%. Yeah, exactly. And that's just killing it and giving it to the rural folk. So that's going to be fantastic. All right. Uh, soon, very, very soon, we have 20% literacy. So that's going to be really, really good. Uh, civil progress minus... And the political interest group strength minus 25%. Let's do that. Fantastic. Uh, Low strike in... Oh, really? Both these sucks. Uh, but I am guess I'm going to pick that one. All right. Democracy is saved? Oh, because the coup failed? Really? Oh, wait, wait. What's going to happen if this actually doesn't work out? If we fail... Oh, what? Are you kidding me? Oh, maybe I should have double-checked this. How about I just cancel that temporarily and um, we go colonial right here and we try to do a little colonial resettlement. Maybe it will hold you off. No, no, it, it, it doesn't. And we're going to have revolution from it. Okay, wow. So we just threw away time right there. So we're just going to have to accept that we failed that. And you, my dear sir. Yeah, exactly. Where, where are the Intel just... Oh, right there. You are going to be really pissed at us. Uh, let's fix that. Wait, did that really time out? Or were we just... Did we lock out? I think we locked out. No, there. Failed petition. Minus 14. Okay. We did not lock out. Damn it. Uh, Marketing Let's go for protectionist. Oh, wait, wait, wait. We're simply going to try to do... Oh, wow, we're starting different laws. <sighs> I think I still want to go protectionist, and then we're going to trade from it, so we earn as much as possible from our current loss. Uh, I do want to have it kind of... We might open it up later, but let's... let's Since that's one law that's pretty good for now. <sighs> 15 tariffs on imports, 10-10, yeah, exactly. 
and then 30 percent yeah exactly let's try to push that and it is predicting that we're gonna earn 5.5k more so um let's let's do that change so 20 percent literacy heck yeah we have 40 million radicals slightly worrisome but um we can surely work that out the art are truly doing nothing that's awesome uh next law we're gonna do is definitely remove serfdom uh, we should have probably just gone through with it and just accepted that loss. I was thinking maybe we can stop that petition by doing the law immediately. Apparently that's one of those things that does not happen. Uh, like you can stop a revolution if you start doing the law or anything like that. Doesn't work with those kinds of petitions. Good to know. Uh, anything else? Come on. Just su succeed with that, please. 61%. Oh, we have so really quick... Law times, honestly, righteous government, all right. And Nepal wants the defensive back. No, we're probably gonna annex you sooner or later, so let's not. Uh, 19K, yeah, right, right, right. We're still earning too much money. Uh, oh, you don't have enough infrastructure. Let's do it in Madras instead. So let's remove the ones in Delhi and we're gonna have to fix that infrastructure as well, please. Oh, God, we're missing so much wood. I just wanted to finish what we were doing, and then we're gonna do... Actually, we're gonna do it right now, I think. Uh, let's see. So, I need quite a bit of wood. So, we're gonna do 29 right there, and we're gonna do 23 right there. But, in the meantime, we are gonna do a few in North and South Bengal. Just fixing the infrastructure right there. Uh, let's get, like... Two more built railways right there, and begin with... Um, two more built railways. Uh, well, actually, two railways to start with let's see an action really again come on just get me that let them celebrate fine uh government reform 80 percent oh really only 80 that's kind of terrible and there we go we're losing 9k that's fantastic uh what do you want mercantilism and landowners uh let's see 67 yeah that's it's gonna be fine come on push it through right now at least first step yeah thank you We have so many of these revolution events, it's ridiculous. Uh, sure, let's do that. 18 million people right there. <sighs> Mostly peasants. Your standard living isn't super high, so if we could fix that. That would be pretty great. Yeah. You have food. But you don't have very much more. Well, you have food, clothes, and furniture. Come on, why are you so <laughs> unhappy? Please. Uh, let's see. Strata. Oh my god. I'm gonna go for this, I think. I think we were lucky right there. Self-defense. Oh my lord. Come on, please. Uh, sure, let's accept that. Uh, there we go. Let's Come on, accept that. Thank you. Getting new military laws. Let's get that skirmish infantry up and rolling. So you're going to need ammo now. Which we definitely don't have any production of. Yep. So let's get uh, Ceylon to be our ammo maker. <laughs> and let's just push that through. Come on. UK still no any, not any big great war. Uh, clothing line right there. Let's cancel that. Demand a discombination, disarm. We need all the support we can get. Sure, let's do that. Uh, this civil war is not going to happen, so we're fine. Come on, there we go. Thank you, protectionist. And now we're going to go surf them. Really? Come on, we still can't do this. Oh, homestead, I mean. Uh, four more months we need to wait. Wait, that was a revolt against me? I for some reason thought that was a war with the UK. Oh, we don't even need to mobilize our men. Seems like... Um, well, UK is taking, taking care of it. I love that they keep supporting me all of these things. <laughs> it's fine. Alright, there we go. Done. Thank you very much. Let's see. We're missing tools, iron, and... Oh my god. They're like, the three things you really don't want to be missing. Honestly. And, yeah... So, that wood part is definitely going to be mostly fixed. So, iron tools. I 
Ah, let's fix that. Thank you. Soil enrichment. Let's not forget about that. Let's get this. Let's get that. Cool. Yes. Okay. So I think we're going to begin with that iron need. Uh, yeah. And of course, we don't have enough qualified people for it. But we're going to get 10 more right there. And I'm going to go into tools. And we're going to get in South Bengal. Yeah. 10 more right there. North and South Bengal seems to be our production hubs for everything. So that's also what we're going to continue doing. Uh, we've got dialects right there. Thank you for that. And I don't actually remember what that was for. Yes, now I remember. It was so I can go right there and bump up our universities to work a bit better. There we go. Annex that. Very nice. Let's see. Sure, we can get the logistics just because we can. And it's shortly done. Otherwise, dynamite. I would love to get that, but it's a bit too far away. Let's get this and this. Let's fix our economy a bit more. All right, we have quite a bit of gold reserves. Very nice. And we have also gone over time. So, um, not as an exciting episode, but we are starting, I think, to sort out our nation. It was a bit of a pain with the landowners. They just keep going for this. And they're 21, but if 21 is all that they have... Yeah, exactly. They're 21 right now. And they don't have that recent revolution beatdown penalty. That's pretty good, I think. We're gonna change the serfdom law. Uh, oh yeah, we can begin right now. Uh, begin the serfdom law. Force them to uh, give up. E well, force them to give up. Force them down with even more power. That's a 50% political strength bonus. So, one step at a time. Oh, 98. Fantastic. So, they're not actually going to be able to, for, well, have a revolution because of it. I would like to avoid another war with it. Uh, let's see. So, we're just going to keep building up wood. We're going to fix the tools, iron, and then begin our coal production. Oh, God. If we have so much we need to do. We have so much we need to do. And we're also waiting for the UK to get a um, large war with someone in Europe. So we can begin our independence movement. But um, we'll see exactly how that's going to work itself out. I hope you still enjoyed this episode. That you will like, comment, subscribe. And give me any more hints or suggestions in the comments. And I'll see you guys next time. Bye. And bye.